everybody's jaw on the floor. He is a hand balancing star. Here's Andre Mararu. Hand balancing is about strength, flexibility, but most importantly, it's about the right state of mind. You have to be present in your body fully. Growing up, I wasn't that good at school. I didn't like public education. And I started to lose the sense of direction in my life. I did not know what I was doing or where I was going to end up until I discovered circus. Suddenly, I had a purpose and a goal and a belief that if I just work hard, I could become somebody. In general, I'm a solitary person. Say, if when I perform hand balancing on the stage, I'm no longer alone. It's like I speak the language without actual words, but in images and sounds and feelings. It is just like showing my very soul, like my innermost being. This is my chance to share my soul and my heart with the world. Absolutely incredible, Andre Mararu. All the judges and every other person in Radio City Music Hall on their feet. Howie, talk to him. You know, what I love about this show is it, we call it a variety show because you can see anything here. And I think, sir, you just showed us everything. You know, you are a hand balancer, you are a ballet dancer, you are a strength act, you are a contortionist, you are an artist, and you excel in every one of those. It's thrilling to see you, to watch you, and just to be on the same show as you. Thank you, it's an honor. Thank you so much. Judge Stern. You know, you said it best in your package. You said that I express myself in a language of movement. And, you know, this is a language we all understand. You're not up there, there's no words, but we all get what you're saying. You communicate with us. Now, I don't care how they dress this thing up, if they put you in some weird little wicked forest with paint lights, <laughs> it doesn't matter. The truth is they could put you in a closet with the lights out and you'd still entertain us. This is compelling. Every time I see you, you get better and better. You're terrific. Vote for this guy. Heidi. I love what you do. I mean, to me, you're like a human pretzel. It's unbelievable what you do. It really is. And I would bend over backwards and sideways and forwards and backwards really? and whatever. For you to go to the finals, I hope America feels the same way and votes you for Vote. Mel B. What? Vote Good for you. 
since nobody else mentioned it, there were a few hiccups, am I correct, during your performance? Now, I have to... Yeah, yeah there was. Let, let's be honest. Now, the reason why I point that out is because, you know what? It didn't matter. You still captivated everybody. It was still memorable and mesmerizing, and I still don't know how you do it. You have me on the edge of my seat yet again. Brilliant. Wow. What a remarkable, incredible performance. And uh, even as Mel B speaks to, you know, a couple of the hiccups, I think that just really expresses the difficulty of what you do. I mean, the last time I seen you, and it's just my opinion, it seems like this was way more difficult than the last act we saw you perform, correct? Uh, you know, many people wrote me saying, well, you're going to surprise us next time, right? And I said, well, I hope so. And um, I put some work into it, and hopefully uh, you've seen what you wish to see. Did you see what you wish to see? If so, you know what you got to do. You got to vote for my man, Andre. It's that simple. If you want to keep his dream alive, vote tonight.